I went on a camping trip and had to wake up at 5.30 in the morning. Lovely! So then we hopped on the coach. This is kind of, um, yeah, it's gonna be a three-parter, but here we go. The Scouto Camping Tropo. Oh yeah, pretty, pretty lit. So after getting to our designated area, after waking up at 5.30, we were off. We drove and drove. But, to be honest, I was kind of worried while driving, because our life was in the hands of our leaders, and our leaders aren't actually that bad. Wait, no, they're awful! There's the digger. He was our designated driver for the trip. Then we had the iron. The iron. The iron man. Yes, and then we... Then we had the Vicinator, oh yes. Finally we had the Stot- the Stonic. So in the morning, before we got into the, um, van- <laughs> That sounds so creepy saying that out loud. We were all partnered up, or well, we kind of got into our own partners, and sat down in the coach. I was with Josh, obviously. If you don't know who Josh is, he spoke one amazing line in one of my older videos. Um, I'll- I'll have a quick play. Play the- play the clip, John. Okay, John. Guys, you- just stop swinging. Or you're gonna die! No! You numpty! Why are we still here? Just to suffer? Stay in school. Don't do drugs. No! Well, now you've just been informed, um, quite depthly about Josh. Now I can commence with the coach journey. We got there. And that's pretty much the entire coach journey summed up for you. Okay, well we had a few service station stops which were quite chaotic. But apart from that, yeah, it was pretty good actually. Okay, so once we got there, we found out that the previous campers had their tents blown away in the night, so the owners of the land were kind enough to let us stay to let us stay in their little croft area kind of thing. Me and Josh were lucky because oh, we got this really soft chair which you could go to the side of it and pull the thing and your legs go out. Yeah, that was pretty, pretty cool. <laughs> ha! So we slept on that and then we woke up in the morning. Well, what do you think we were gonna do? Not wake up in the morning? Okay, well, so we woke up in the morning and went to get breakfast. Breakfast was nice. We had pretty much the same thing every morning. Egg and bacon rolls, which I can't argue with. They were, they were, they were pretty good. So after that, we all went out to our first trip. Uh, this first trip was pretty good. Cause I met the best adult man I have ever met in my entire life. Now this guy, I'm, I'm making an entire video about this day because there's so much I have to go over about this man. He's well done, well done. Just get, if, if in the comments type hashtag justice for one man guy. So after we got back from that place, we were all told to put on our waterproofs, and so I went up to the place that we slept last night to grab my waterproofs, as in waterproof coat and waterproof well, um, legs. And, um, I couldn't find my waterproofs. I found my coat, but I couldn't find my legs anywhere. And they, oh boy, the leaders got mad. John, where are your waterproofs? Hmm, no, ah, <laughs> papyrus. Couldn't find them. No. Oh. <laughs> and that translates to right. I'm angry. Full kit inspection tomorrow. 